All right, guys, welcome back with me. So now today I want to talk about the uh, new update that we are going to have. Actually, this is the update that launched today. And wow, well, it's very interesting. Despite the movie rescheduled that is supposed to be launched this summer, somehow this movie is rescheduled uh, during the fall this month, this year, or maybe winter, I forgot. But uh, who really do not wait for Marvel Black Widow and I really love the artwork here. The artwork is really beautiful, really amazing, really uh, realist. I really like the design, the artwork right now. And during this update, we are focusing on these four characters. As you can see, we have Yelena, Black Widow, Taskmaster, and then this Captain Russia. Okay, his name is not Captain Russia, but I really forgot who the heck he is. But alright guys, so let's get inside and check what this new update really brings to us. Alright, so now it's unzipping. As you can see, it's quite a uh, one gigabyte for a game, mobile game, that's quite huge. So this is the update alert. We have the new legendary battle focusing on the movie as usual. And then we are going to have new characters. Wow, this is surprising. Normally every month we have three new characters. But now we have only two characters, but I think this is a good strategy that uh, Netmarble has to think about because they are having like 200 characters more and especially for a new player or any returning player that haven't played this game for a long time it's gonna be really annoying if you have to catch up with the characters progress that they always develop every month. Alright, now and then we have also the new items, which is Future Pass. So I will talk about this future letter, what Future Pass is, and whether this is really uh, important or not. Okay, so now let's check on the Legendary Battle. As usual, we have the Normal and then the Extremes Legendary Battle. Wait, where's my song? Let me put some song, right? Okay, there you are. Okay, so now if we go into the legendary battle, guys, uh, if we go into the, well, the, as you can see, legendary battle is based on the Disney's Marvel movie, especially starting from Thor Ragnarok until now, they always keep up with the movies or release and also making the, um, the legendary battle mode here. It's kind of really, uh, fun and Maybe for some person, it's also uh, they are afraid that this is gonna be a spoiler for the movie. I guarantee this is no spoiler. Maybe it tells you the major story, but it's not 100% accurate based on the movie. Otherwise, why Disney would do that? Spoil their own movie that is not launched yet. And so if you want to go to the extremes and gain on all of these possible rewards that you can achieve, then it's gonna require you to purchase it for 2500 crystal and there is no always discount never ever netmarble discount black widow i mean uh, legendary battle extreme so the only thing that i can unlock now is the normal one which is free and let's do this So this is the new uniform, if I have it then I will have like some sort of a better reward But who cares about it? 1050 crystals I can buy it but uh, that's not my focus right now Okay so let's enjoy it Okay we are in the Buddha best right now Oh it's a Buddha best, if this is really true that the movie also gonna be in the Buddha best then maybe we can I don't know, this is just my assumption. Maybe we can see also Clean Burton Hawkeye, but I don't know. Oh, this is her sister. knew it so must be also as pain in the ass uh, strong as her right all right so now we are going to fight Yelena Bellafa oh that's easy man 
attack and remove the granite before it active. Where are you? Ah, okay. Oh, the six skill is really impressive. Okay, I got like the North Stone, Gold, and some Biometrics. I like it. Oh, see, it's also Black Widow. So we have two Black Widow. Okay, so now if I start it, then I'm gonna play as a Yelena Belova. Oh, I can buy her for 2,500 crystal, guys. You know what? Okay, let's go to the character setup. And let's see any unavailable characters that I have, which is both of them are new. You can check here that in order to acquire Yelena Belova, you have to... You know what I mean, right? You have to buy this 20 biometrics daily for and it's gonna take forever and if you use the rank up ticket it costs you around 2800 or 2600 crystals so I think the, if you ask me the cheapest way to gain the legendary battle of uh, this new premium character the, the, the easiest way to, to, to get her is to buy it from here which is only 2500 crystal Alright, um, what do you guys think? Should I buy it? Alright, don't give a shit, I'm gonna buy it here right now. So I have her already on the 6 star. Yes, okay, but she looks really um, dull, yeah, I mean like she has to be upgraded with the uniform level and whatsoever. Alright, let's just, okay, I don't have crystals to buy her uniform right now. So let's just get it started, alright? It has it. It must be tough. I don't think I can pass through it because my Elena is still level one. Oh, Alexei, I guess is the the red guy, right? Okay, that's the Taskmaster arrow. Fight him. Red Canadian. than the okay we got this all right that's not bad Alexis Sostakov Alright, so the third one seems we are going to fight the Taskmaster himself, right? We'll see. Oh, I really love this game graphic, man. For mobile phone, this is really nuts. Ooh. Oh, 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 this is definitely new, man. This is definitely new. Uh, wow, it's kind of fun. So what should I do, man? Ah, I can launch some attack, right, right, right. Oh, shit, how do I do that?
my goodness. It's time to blow. There you go, Taskmaster. I just roll over your APP, right? Wow, this is really cool, man. Look at this design. Looks really sick. Ooh, 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 what the heck is this man? You know what, guys? Black Widow getting the tier 3 is really uh, lovely. Okay, so we got gold, uh, norm stone, and also another biometric. This is really amazing. Okay, that's enough with the legendary battle. If you have more crystals to spend, then you can go for extreme. And then the only one that is really important in the extreme mode here is the CTP of this. Uh, I don't know, I forgot the name, but the CTP also, and also the. Uh, yeah, the CTP of inside, which is gonna be really useful for your PvE character, and then also the advanced potential enhanced decap. Okay, folks, so that is number one. And now let's go to the character itself. So we have here the Red Guardian, which is you can buy it for free as long as you have the free biometrics, you can recruit him. And I think that's what I'm gonna do. I gotta recruit him. First of all, let me open my free purchase create here and then um, okay as you can see I have a lot of uh, free biometrics how many biometrics do I have in total 150 285 Wow, 425, 525. I have 525 free biometrics, but is that enough to recruit uh, Alexei until level 6? I'm not sure. Well, let's do it later, guys. We have, we are not in a rush to getting him right now, but uh, let's focus and check who the heck he is. So basically, wait, what is this going on? Why, why I couldn't? Alright, so this is basically basically combat, and then if you acquire his um, uniform, for sure he's gonna have a lot of skill improvement. And he got a lot of striker tiers, and then uh, he is free as long as you have biometrics, you can recruit him. So we we will not talk about details about these characters yet because there has to be some research, and it's gonna take some time and observation to know more about the Red Guardian specialty. But normally free character, uh, they are good as for the moment, but as the time goes by, their usefulness will not be that high. Alright, so this is new, okay, so the new character is showing up front, but now it's no longer there. It's okay, doesn't really matter. Where is she, where is she, where is she? Oh, I have a lot of characters right now. Okay, um... I'm just gonna put everything and try to let's see how much do I can level up with her level 49 okay maximum level reach that's cool I'm gonna have some crystals for free Oh my dear, 
I still need to yeah I do well I already subscribed for the uh, her biometric so I will get it on daily basis and then I can try to use it to improve her character here so it's okay so let's see the mastery ticket I have the six mega mastery ticket I'm just gonna use it on her because I have a lot of items right Wow rank 1400 already that's crazy okay so yeah I just gonna talk that instead of combat we also in addition have the uh, speed type character which is Yelena Belova she got her uniform as you can see and I suggest you to buy it if you have more crystal spare because you're gonna make her really useful and as I said also that I will not go deeper into the um, analysis because it's gonna take some time and observation so that's the two new characters we are required right today and now let's talk about the third characters that we also get today uh, it's basically an old character that we already have on our rosters this is the free character that you have when you play this game for the first time but what makes this really interesting now is that this uniform if you buy her uniform which is I guarantee that it's gonna make her really really strong and now she can be also level up to tier 3 as well so that's really wonderful right that marble being really good by implementing this update even though the movie is not really shit on tether so what else that we get on this update ah don't forget to go to the taskmaster guy because he is quite a strong super villain uh, despite his free characters and I couldn't imagine if you uh, equip him his uh, uniform he's gonna be like really really strong alright so that's all for the new update uh, let's talk about the future pass okay what the heck is actually future pass so we are started with the basic package and then we are having the legendary package if you in my currency it's gonna cost me around ten dollars to get it and then as for the legendary package uh, sorry this is legendary and then this must be I don't know titanium or something like that a mythic yeah it has to be mythic it's gonna cost you around thirty dollars so in total you have to spend forty dollars just to upgrade it from basic to mythic and what do we actually get as you can see we have this awakening uh, materials we have the CCF non-stone crystals and the ultimate things that we could achieve is this boat mega rank up ticket and also the tier 2 mega advancement ticket um, I gotta say I gotta say as for the mega rank up ticket actually you can buy it like every one week or two weeks they always uh, sell it on the store costs you around 2800 or 2600 crystals so instead of purchasing ten dollars then actually you can get this material every week or two weeks I forgot and as for this this is really expensive uh, if you buy it on the store it's really costly but if you buy it here it's also not cheap so it's up to you if you want to buy this but it's guaranteed if you get this then you will get this because you cannot get this without getting this and remember that this is, will be end in the next 29 days so it's exactly 30 days in total and you can see the number above 43 44 45 until 50 it is the grid up your grid is now only one and in order to upgrade then you have to use crystal i still don't know how basically this is work but maybe you can uh maybe if you wanna if you want to increase the pass grid by purchasing the crystal it's like the short card to increase your up uh, your grid easily but maybe you can also use this if you press on the question mark button you see that there are like anything that you are doing in this game gonna give you some points and this point as level as it's increased maybe it's gonna uh increase your grade for example like that so I assume if we already fill the cost from 18% to 100% then my grid will be up from 1 until 2 so that's how I think so basically what you're doing 
uh, once you buy this legendary package and this mythic package you are not automatically getting this reward but you have to work for it until you are grade 50 and you have only 30 days in order to acquire all of them so you get what I mean right so this is how the future pass has the new feature working and it's only work only for 30 days okay so we already talked about the characters we already talked about the legendary battles and we already talked about the future pass the new things that we also get is also from the Shadowland if you see my previous video I on the run now to try to aim for the level 120 the highest floor that I forgot is only 61 that, that's already like almost one year ago so I believe now I can double up or maybe getting uh, 10 or 20 more floors uh, they say during the patch note that the Shadowland giving you a better reward right now I don't know how this is really worth we are going to prove it on the different video and I maybe I'm gonna do it today or tomorrow alright so what else different now is the world boss if you will boss normally you can do it five times in one day now you can do more it doesn't mean that they have more rewards now no you still do it five times but now they have the training mode and training mode can be accessed after you are having all of your five remaining entries so I already tried with a different account on a different gadget so after you do this five times and then you will have access to the training mode in order to test your characters, your strikers combination and everything so you get what this new world boss uh, update they give to us so uh, so far I think that's it we have new characters Yelena and uh, Red Guardian we have Wonder Woman uh, sorry Black Widow tier 3 we have the legendary battle from the Black Widow upcoming movie and then we have the Shadowland reward upgrade and then we have the world boss training mode as well and in addition if you want to spend more money you also are and you can buy this future pass mode so guys I think that's all that Netmarble tried to provide to us this time with this new update I don't know what you think I don't know whether you really gonna like it or not but yeah who doesn't really want to play with the Black Widow thank you for watching guys have a good day bye bye